Good morning, my good people. Uh, yesterday, I noticed this dent on my car, and I also noticed a much bigger dent here on this side. I, I did manage to pop some of it out. It was a lot worse. And then this morning, I had a flat tire. Anyways, uh, we got picked Max up from school. He wasn't feeling good. Come along for the ride. What do you say? Will he make it? Uh, so close to this car. Uh, oh yeah, there we go. That's professional driving right there. Sorry, it took us a while. What's the matter? Tick, just tick. Why's your Why's your tummy hurt? Some little Philly break your heart. Wanna go home or you wanna hang out with us? We're gonna go get some dog food and go to run a couple errands. I always find it amusing how baby chickens sleep. They almost look dead. I mean, look at this guy right here. Looks like he died. Oh, he woke up. And then they get older and they perch. Oh, they're so cute. Look at them. These are called silkies. And they're known for their fuzziness. I had one, it was one of my first chickens ever, and it died, and it was this age. It had the pasty butt, I don't know if that's what you call it, that. they were unhealthy. Are you the one making all that noise? Hey, hey, what are you doing? What are you doing? You look like a little wolf. You look like a little wolf. Hey. We just left. Rural King and got some food at barbecue place and he's got to go to the bathroom. And I think it's funny because it's not number one. Usually it's me freaking out and I have to go and, and he is freaking out. Like he's like shaking his legs. You see that? I'm behind every damn slow driver. How does it feel like? It feels like shit. Literally. <laughs> Damn. You have a turtle head poking out. It's funny. It is, because... I don't got no turtle head poking out. I got a log <laughs> trying to play peekaboo. <laughs> I don't know where I came up with that. I got to go so bad. Uh, Suffer. It's so hot. Oh. You're sweating. It's so hot. Right here, you're going to miss the turn. Oh. I stopped at grandma's if I was you. It's close. I had to go really bad like this the oh, other day. Oh, give me a cup. <laughs> oh, come on. Hurry up. Watch it. You're going in the freaking road, dude. Oh, I'm not going to make it. I'm not going to make, yeah, make, make it. Yeah, you are. I'm not going to make it. I'm not going to make it. I'm not going to make it. Yes, you are. <gasps> oh, my God. <laughs> oh We're not gonna make it. What if you would have got an accident? You would have pooped yourself. Oh, that would have been good. <laughs> At least it would have came out. Relax. Uh, man, this is the worst feeling ever, man. Like, I need to hold it for like, Open the garage. like five hours. Oh, I don't even care about the garage. <laughs> hey, let me run. Don't run on your poop yourself. Oh. Don't run on your poop yourself. <laughs> Some hand sanitizer. Why would you do that? Because you need it. What? Put it on your hands. Here, I'll take some. Here. What's up? 
What is up? So here in the comment section, I want you to, I mean, it could be a question to me and Melissa, any of the kids. I mean, a Ariel doesn't live with me, but she's always with me. You could ask her some questions too. But, you know, just ask away. What's, like she said, what's your favorite color? What's your favorite shoes? And we'll make a whole video about it. Who's your favorite comedian, favorite movie, or movies? Yeah. And yeah, ask those questions in the comment section and I'll answer them in an upcoming video. And I'll also put your name in there, give you guys a shout out. But also, it needs to be appropriate, please, for yeah. my children. Don't be asking me questions about, you know, just use common sense with your questions, all right? They gotta be friendly, especially questions about my kids and things like that. But anyways, um, you know, if you wanna ask me like, uh, what's the size of my shoe? You know, you can ask. <laughs> Anything that you just wanna get to know us more. Anything. Well, okay. I'm dreaming of mealworms for my chickens. Just like the ones that I bought at World King. Okay, hold on. Let me open the bag first. All right, get off my kicks. Whoa! I guess you want some mealworms, Shay. Just don't go poopy on me. Ooh, here. Yummy. Oh, look. Falcon. Or Falco. Oh, actually, it's Falcon, I think. They kind of look alike, even though they're two different birds. Yummy. Whoa. Okay, I gotcha, I gotcha, I gotcha. Ooh, it's a worm frenzy. Hey, Quinn. Quinn is a superstar. I had him at the end of a video called, uh, I think, giving random people $30,000. Video went viral. It's got over a million, I think a million, 1.2 million, something like that, views. Wasn't expecting it to get that many views, but at the end of the video, I'm holding Quinn, and it's funny, like, if you read some of the comments on that video, there's a lot of hateful ones, which, you know, I get that all the time. But people are like, nice duck, I love your duck, I have ducks, so it's kind of cool, like, people interacting with Quinn. Wow. You guys are hogs. Now, I noticed something really cool. I'm not sure if it's a coincidence or not. Maybe it's because I, you know, I feed my chickens every day. But I noticed that the chickens, the hens, because I have nothing but hens. I don't have any any boys. The boys I did have, I actually mailed them to a friend. It's in another video if you want to check it out. But the female chickens, they're always. I mean, every chicken is shy. I mean, that's why. That's why they say, hey, uh, you know, hey, are you being chicken or whatever? They're real shy, even raising them as little babies. They've always been shy. But as soon as they start hatching eggs, they become a little bit more friendlier. I don't know why. They, you go to pet them and they just kind of squat. So, hey, what are you doing, Gwen? Uh, she, she's one that's pretty friendly. Because this one right here, the one that hopped on me earlier. Where is she? That's Shay. She used to run from me, man. And now she comes right up to me and lets me pet her. I'll hold her every once in a while. Man, that's April. She kind of like runs from me right now. But as soon as she starts laying eggs, she's going to be nicer too. All right. The other day I was going for a jog, strolling through the neighborhood, and I came across these. And they happen to be my size. I couldn't help but pick them up because I had an idea maybe like a week prior to make a video about walking in heels for the first time. You know, guys walking in heels for the first time. And when I seen these on the ground while I was jogging, I was it kind of like reminded me and they were like, you know, hey, pick me up. So this video is meant to be, I got a buddy coming from Miami which is like five hours away, he's gonna come. He's done a couple videos with me, I've done a couple videos with him. He's a really awesome guy, Lewis. And we're gonna wear some high heels together. Now, I invited the boys to do it too. They've never walked in high heels. Sadly, this is 
the first time. I had a lot of fun this morning trying to put these on because I've never put high heels on ever, ever, or ever wanted to. But let me tell you something. One thing I do love about them is I'm about 5'10". When you put these things on, I'm like 6'3". <laughs> so so is Ethan. Ethan's going to be about 6'3". So oh go ahead, throw them on. That, that's a size like nine and a half in guys. And what? His toenails My toenails so got dirty from that day we did the chicken thing. Oh, okay. They're hard, right? Wait, record me standing next to you. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> You're like super tall, man. All right, all right. So, I mean, me and Ethan are almost the same height, so you can see how much taller he is than me <laughs> with those on. All right, all right, Max, you gotta try them on. I wanna try them on to Walmart. So I wanna make you up, like a surprise when you to Walmart. So I get at Walmart, it's like brand new, so I just- Dude, let me tell you something. It's gonna take a long time before you become a professional at walking in those. <laughs> how was that, Ethan? Fun. Uh, Malia show you how to walk in those. Yeah. She's a pro. Yeah, I am. I wore high Like slip on. <laughs> yeah, you're not gonna be able to wear those. Yeah, we'll see. All right. I mean, the pumps on them are like freaking like that big, man. All right. Your feet don't even fit in there. I'm just getting up. See, Don't hurt yourself. Oh, I will. Now let me show you. How you're pretty tall. Let me show you how the pros okay. walk in these things. Oh, the pros. <laughs> I'm waiting. Hand on her hips. Yeah, that's how they walk in Do that again? No. That's funny. All right, Max, toe them on. You gotta put them on. Okay. You guys' toes are disgusting. What yeah. the hell? I'm not gonna let you put my freaking nice sandals on or pumps. Why are they that dirty? Nice. Those are already dirty. I cleaned them with alcohol. You're such a goofball. Whoa! All right, let Max try them on. Oh, my buddy Lewis is, you know, he's he's like me. He's got tattoos. We're gonna both wear tank tops, show off our muscles, you know, a little bit of muscles we do got. And uh, we're gonna look very like manly walking in these things. So it's gonna be really goofy. You follow me yet, Max? Let's check. Hey, try to run. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Dad. Hey, look, he's almost taller. Okay, you ready? What's up, Dad, bro? <laughs> this is gonna be funny we might go like to the mall and walk by people i might even maybe trip and fall next to people with them i just don't want to hurt myself that's my biggest fear i kind of injured my ankle a few years back and i swear i still kind of feel that pain depending on how my ankle's positioned oh <laughs> do the nae nae Damn, dude, you're actually uh, pretty good on those for the first time. Um, you know how you're talking about tank tops? Yeah. There's this kid, what, me and Ethan and Max eat breakfast together, and his name's Michael. Oh, God. He wore, like, a muscle shirt to school, and the lady, she was like, she called him up to the stage, because we have a stage, and mm -hmm. she's like... You're not allowed to wear muscle shirts. And then people were like, where are the muscles? <laughs> <laughs> Let me see what you got. <laughs> <laughs> Dang. I'm so strong. Yeah, that's how you gotta get some muscles there. You get this, put it, put it in your hand, and uh, uh, lift it like that. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> I have get muscles. I'm not sure that's the best you can do at home. Yeah, if you you want to eat food, what you gotta do? Yeah. 
Uh -oh. I use the milk. Mm. That better not spill, dude. Chill out with that. Mm. Doing squats with the milk. <laughs> all right. Finally, it's working. I did all. I used to work out with you guys when you were babies. I'd like bench press you guys. I can't do that now. You guys are he too heavy. Still do it to me. I could probably bench press you and Malia. He's like, but Ethan, man, Ethan almost weighs my weight. What are you doing? Are you doing the Ethan dance? Let's do the Ethan dance. Do the Ethan dance, Max. That's not the Ethan dance. Do the Ethan dance. Do this with me, come on, do it. Oh, you want me to do it too? <laughs> it's not the Ethan dance. I'm going to cool.